I'm very excited. What a spectacle. My daughter saw it a year ago. She's been raving about it for 12 months. Third time seeing the show, so I'm a bit of a fan. We flew down from Sydney today just to be here, so that's quite a serious commitment from us. I've driven past the theatre so many times and seen it all decked out in Harry Potter stuff, so I'm so excited a year in to, to see it, finally. It's my great uh, pleasure to welcome you uh, to the Princess Theatre today as the production celebrates our one-year anniversary. This has been an incredible production. It's only going to be here in Melbourne, something we're very proud of, and we're delighted to be able to be part of this. I don't want to be in Gryffindor. <laughs> Just because everyone wants to be in Gryffindor, so I don't. I mean, I feel like people think they want to say Slytherin, but I'm going to say Hufflepuff because, like, you know, it's Hufflepuff. No, I'm very happy to leave it to the magic of the hat. You know, it's not for me to say which house I should be in. That's, that's up to a hat. That's a hat's job. My sisters know all the spells. I don't know any of the spells, so I'm going to give myself a nine because they're at ten. Well, I named my cat Draco Meowfoy, so I feel like that says a lot. <laughs> I mean, I've seen all the movies and I've read the books to my kids, but I'm not, I'm not full nerd, but half nerd. Yeah.